everyone, Hannah here. Welcome back to the channel. For anyone that's new, welcome. My name is Hannah. I have a new lounge fly today from the Disney store in a lovely Disney box. This new collection, it's the Hydrangea collection. Now, it's sometimes it's hard to tell with pictures online as to the exact colour of something. So I figured I'd wear white. I've kind of gone Elsa with a little bit of blue. It's got nothing to do with the Hydrangea bag. I just figured if I wore white, it will show the backpack colour a bit better. I also have a couple different blue sequin lounge fly as well so when I've kind of shown the backpack I'm going to grab a couple of those and hold them up side by side so we can get a better idea of kind of the exact colour of it because hydrangea doesn't really mean much to me but it's a sequin. It is one of these lovely boxes, sorry if this bit is a bit loud, hopefully it's one fluid movement. We will see. Are you ready? Oh lovely. I like it when that happens. You can colour these boxes in if you want to. Why not? They used to have a, like a white background, whereas it seems like it's all this brown stuff now. I don't know if this might be easy to recycle. I don't know. Put that bit back in the box. Right. Where is she? Oh, packing slip really quickly. £85. She's a little bit expensive. Sorry if this bit's a bit noisy. Right, pop her there for a moment. We will get the box out of the way. Also, if you've seen my videos before, my voice is going again, so apologies. This might end up being a debacle. The voice is going again. And I've just thought, I don't have my box opener or any scissors. And there's scissors on the back of the packet. I'm not very prepared today, am I? Losing my voice, I don't have my scissors. I even done an unboxing. Oh, there we go. That was relatively easy. We like that. Okay, I'm just going to get all the packaging off straight away. Yeah, I didn't think so. The price tag, well, the tag doesn't have a price on there. I wonder if they do that so they can then just decide the price when they get them. Tiny bit sneaky. Okay, here. And then I suppose if there's ever a wrong price on there, it'd be an absolute debacle. I have to take them all off. So I guess it does actually make sense not to have the price on this tag. So. I take it back. Right. Oh, I'm always nervous with taking these ear bits off because I feel like, oh, loving the colour by the way. But I get nervous with these ear bits in case a sequin kind of flings across the room. This colour. I love her already. Oh, well, I'm going to move that because it hit the bottom of the camera. We don't want that. She, oh, she might be perfect. I don't think there's any wonkiness at all. Look at this. See, I, I, blah, blah, blah. I don't know how I would try and explain this colour. So I'm going to use some of the other backpacks later on to kind of hold them up together. Because I'm not great at that. But that's why I figured wearing white would at least help a bit. Because if I wore a blue jumper it might kind of discord this col dis distort this colour a little bit. She's beautiful. What I will say though, I don't, is it supposed to be like this? A lot of the other sequins, they are kind of shiny, shiny sequins. This one seems to have a bit of a matte finish to it, so it's not as shiny. Sh she's still shiny, but not as shiny as some of the other sequins. Sorry, my brain's not working, is it? Look at this. She's absolutely stunning. So she does have the ears and a bow. Do they all have ears and a bow? They do all have ears and a bow. So I take back what I was going to say when they sometimes don't have a bow. They do. It's beautiful. Absolutely stunning. And look at the sparkle. This one is a Disney Parks one as well. So there was a pair of ears, which I believe were Loungefly brand ears as well. You can tell because they will have a small tag on one of the sides that says Loungefly on them. So they are a little bit more expensive than kind of the other Disney store ears. But they match the backpack. I did only get the backpack though for this one. There is also a spirit jersey, the UK Shop Disney. Now, the UK Shop Disney always used to do Disneyland spirit jerseys. Paper's falling. Whereas recently they've kind of moved to Walt Disney World jerseys. Which I personally like, because I've not been to Disneyland yet. Yet. One day. One day. One day. Who wants to go with me? Let's just go. Let's just do it. Money? Let's just go. Anyway, back to the lounge light. I'm waffling and getting distracted now. She's stunning. So, Disney Parks and Lounge Flight badge. That has like a matte finish to it as well for the badge. 
and there's also that kind of matte finish around the zips which will go along the top as well because she's covered look at the sequins and there are two side pockets oh now these two side pockets the sequins go down to about there in that side pocket so just bear that in mind that part is a little bit scratchy at the top but you do have two side pockets the back is the beautiful blue colour again the hydrangea blue and that bit's just like a nice soft material you're not going to want sequins on the back of the backpack because then that would just that would snag that would not be fun not at all oh what's the bottom the bottom is the same as the back so we'll do a 360 and then have a look I don't know what the inner lining is because whenever I know that I'm going to get a bag where, wherever it's from whether it's from one of the licensed retailers or from Shop Disney I don't look at the pictures that much because I, I want to see it for myself I don't think she's going to have an inner pocket just because Parks ones don't tend to she might though she might surprise me but she probably won't bung it down there I really like this. There isn't. There's not an inner pocket. There's not an inner pocket. This lining is beautiful. The base colour is kind of this same. Actually, no, that's a little bit darker, isn't it? So the straps are a tiny bit darker than the back. The base colour is this slightly darker. There's tiny little Mickey's, and there's also what I can only assume are hydrangea flowers. Someone let me know in the comments. Are these hydrangea flowers? They are beautiful blue flowers though. All the way through. I don't know if they are hydrangeas or not. Somebody let me know. We will find out together. I'm going to check the front pocket as well. And then I'll grab... I'll grab Aqua. Arundel Aqua. And the Teal Cruise Sequin. Is it? It is... A, they put like a big foam chunk thing in the front pocket so I can't really bend it too much so you might just have to take my word for it that it is the same I'm going to do another 360 and then hold her up again because she's just so sparkly she's beautiful look how she shimmers and can you actually if I hold her up really close can you see what I mean where it's like a slight matte finish on the sequins oh side note as well the sequins are on the back of the ears fully sequined ears which bag was it now the aerial crew oh she's there she now has her pride of place aerial cruise she has sequins on the front not on the back so it's not always a guarantee that they will be on both so i'm going to grab the other two quickly starting off with arundel aqua they're actually not that close color wise but if you have this one and you're unsure, it kind of gives you a little bit of colour reference. It's definitely more aqua than blue, isn't it? But this was my first ever Loungefly backpack. It's this one's fault that started it all, and I got it. I was aware of Loungefly, but I got it because of Frozen. Frozen. Elsa. So, that's the one that started all of this. Right, this one is a bit better. Actually, this one's quite a good match. This is the Cruise Teal Blue sequin gears for a second just have a look okay that is quite similar actually isn't it this one is just a bit darker my cruise mickey has fallen out there was a little blue mickey in there but he fell out but it's fine you would see if i hadn't have said anything you wouldn't have known so cruise teal blue also can you see what i mean i can see it more in person now as well if i kind of do this can you see what i mean with the matte finish of the sequins this one's the shiny shiny also sorry for that dangle this one's the shiny shiny finish whereas this one does have that matte finish to it you can kind of see it a bit better comparing those two together this is a beautiful color i'm kind of i'm wondering now should i have got the ears as well because this could be a beautiful outfit obviously when i tend to use aqua it's mainly for frozen outfits i've not detagged the cruise one just yet but i feel like I don't have another one this sort of colour. The next blue one that I've got is the navy blue cruise one, and that's like a that's a really dark blue. She might get detagged soon. Should I get the ears? And also, anyone that has the spirit jersey, I've noticed these days some of them tend to be really nice and soft, and some of them feel a little bit harder. 
Will someone let me know what material it is? Is it the really soft ones or is it the harder ones? Because that might sway my decision. If it's the really soft ones, then I might just be tempted to get it. Let me know in the comments down below if you've got anything from this new Hydrangea collection. Also, Shop Disney now has the Big Feet plush online. If they had Pegasus, I probably would have gotten him. I don't think they have all of them that they have in the Disney parks. Whether we might get some more, though, because they don't have the Big Big Feet plush either. They've got the medium ones. But there is... Is it... Oh... I can't think now. Is it Dumbo? I'm pretty sure there's like a giant big feet plush that I've seen a picture of. I've got a feeling that it's Dumbo and I'm sure there's another one and it's just completely escaped my brain. But big feet plushies. I love them. They're so good for cuddling. But yeah, let me know if you've got anything from this new Hydrangea collection. But thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!